returning empty containers and the rise in 4DM fees are the number one issues we are facing today. These problems have kept escalating in the last years, culminating this year with well over $100 million in fees charged to motor carriers and beneficial cargo owners. But detention and demurrage are not planned for by any of them. It can completely wipe out small carriers' profit margins or put them out of business. The way business is done has changed. We went from returning empties to the terminal of origin to returning them anywhere and booking mandatory appointments. Our idea for innovation at Blue Cargo addresses the dry edge market and is beneficial to trucking companies, port and terminal operators, 3PLs, freight forwarders, and BTOs. Rules exist and technology is here to help. Since Senator Bill 45, ocean carriers should provide guaranteed empty return location 48 to 72 hours in advance. Technology can help track changes and automate documentation to provide proofs and demand accountability. Truckers should not have to hire a full-time staff just to deal with looking for extension of three days and finding appointments. Our idea to, to achieve the goal of moving containers from port to first mile destination faster, more reliably, and more cost effectively is to create an agnostic platform able to connect to all sources of information, ideally through API, and create a smart dispatch system for truckers. System talking to systems the plan will constantly be up to date and auto book or auto cancel containers drop off, pick up and return. We can ima even imagine adding some kind of insurance level to automatically collect the proofs of the choices made to return containers and particularly showcasing the difficulty to return because of either a lack of appointments, a lack of chassis or restrictive empty return locations. That way, all decisions are backed up and we can change the system from being curative to preventive. This should directly lower detention and demurrage costs. With no more no-shows and less manual mistakes, we will bridge the lack of appointment with optimum resource allocation and increase the number of dual transactions to hopefully reach the 50% target set up recently by the Port of Long Beach as the next top priority. Containers will need to be scheduled one by one manually, not anymore. Same for cancellation. Consequently, a dispatcher will be able to handle more than the maximum of 100 containers a day he can do today. Same for customer service people and tracking company will be able to scale with technology. Only the standardization in communication and data sharing will allow our industry to unlock the power of optimization and AI-powered recommendation. Smart availability must consider many layers of information to be reconciled manually. Container yard location, height in the stack, gate closure, receiving instruction, chassis and appointment availability, driver preferences, dual maximization, etc. We need data to flow in a standardized and reliable way and terminals releasing standard APIs to reach our common goals. System talking to system is in everyone's best interest. We see some terminals first initiatives already now to release standard APIs. This way, terminal operators should not have to fight with no-shows or lack of cancellation anymore. And trucker can use technology to scale their operations. Thank you very much.